Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this message. So today I'm here with the channel messages reading from your person for all of my Aquariuses out there. So if you have Aquarius as your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, this message might apply to you. Your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation, in communication, at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do get started, please keep in mind that this is a general reading for all of my Aquariuses out there, so it might not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it doesn't, please don't take it personally. So let's get started with some messages from your person. You make me feel better. You are my, or you're my confidant. Absence makes the heart fonder. So also Aquarius, please keep in mind that if I'm speaking from your person's perspective, this could be how you feel. The roles could be reversed, just however this reading resonates for you. Um, I feel like with this connection, Aquarius, I want to describe it as like it's been like a long time coming to the point that you are at now with your person um this could be your energy or your person's but i'm getting that someone in this connection really needed to make sure that they were going to be respected and heard and honored from the other person um so i feel like whoever that was and this could very well be you aquarius because i'm i'm sort of getting that energy but it could have been your person or maybe it was the both of you um, but I feel like you, Aquarius, you weren't about to give your all or even show parts of yourself to your person right away. Um, you needed to make sure that you needed to have more trust in them. And this could be something that you are still in the process of working towards. Um, so we have, you make me feel better and you're my confidant. Um, I feel like with the point or like where you're at now within this connection this is a person that you really appreciate because through maybe figuring them out or observing them you were able to realize that there's nothing to have my guard up against or there's nothing to maybe overthink about this person. I feel like this person did show you their true colors and and you Aquarius, you were able to maybe decipher their energy from what you were trying to avoid in the beginning. So I do feel like this person gained your trust. This could be someone where you go to with the you're my confidant. You go to them when you're really feeling unsure about something. Maybe you feel as if your person, and remember this energy can be reversed, you might feel as if your person, they have a clearer mind about things or they might think about things in a more practical way without involving their emotions. Um, they maybe take a step back and look at the bigger picture. Um, this is someone you do trust. Um, and then with the you make me feel better, this is your energy Aquarius. Um, I feel like your person is authentic and maybe a reason to why you were maybe staying away in the beginning is because you wanted to meet someone who had that same authenticity as you, Aquarius. And in order to discover that about someone, it won't happen all at once. You need to fill them out. You need to see how things go. So there may have been a period of separation between you two. We have absence makes the heart fonder. Um, and we'll know more with the cards next to come, but there could have been some distance between you two and maybe you Aquarius, you started to realize like this, this isn't an enemy or this isn't someone who wants to take from me. Um, so I feel like you may have isolated yourself um, to figure some things out for yourself. And then throughout that time, you were able to gather from your person that this is someone who 
wants the best for you in this connection. Heart for heart. Can I let you in? You're not like the rest. So I feel like you, Aquarius, your feelings have, like this person has really grown on you. Um, this could be someone that you didn't even pay attention to at first or in the beginning. Like I said, you, you paced yourself because you knew what could possibly or what you could possibly expect from just meeting someone new. Um, also for confirmation, maybe you've been seeing angel number 444. You might be dealing with possible Aries or Taurus. Um, however, four resonates with you. Um, so I feel like you Aquarius, you might be ready to get even deeper with your person. Maybe because you've been observing more about them, you you might want to know more about them, but more as in you asking the questions, and then you might want to share more about yourself. I feel like you're ready to come closer with this connection. We have the can I let you in. I do feel like this is your energy, Aquarius, but please remember roles could be reversed, so this could very well be how your person is feeling. Um, we have can I let you in, so I feel like this is your energy, Aquarius. Um, you were hesitant at first because you knew what could come ahead with getting to know someone new. Like it doesn't always work out how you would like for it to. And sometimes it's like when you share things about yourself and then something ends up falling off. It's like, what was the point? Like I already exerted like some things when you share them and then it doesn't work out with a person. It's like you would rather have kept that that to yourself. Like now someone else knows this about you it's all about like privacy if you are resonating with that i can be like that as well so we have ken i let you in and i feel like you aquarius you you trust your person um so the answer to that is yes for you we have you're not like the rest um i feel like for you aquarius there may have been like some patterns of just getting to know people and then those people turn out to have like the same intentions and then you Aquarius, you just find it easier to stay to yourself and think things think about things individually or in an individualistic way. And that's the sign of Aquarius. Like you, you, my Aquariuses aren't afraid to walk by themselves um, and honor their power and their individuality and how and who they are so i feel like with the you're not like the rest this is the this is how you view your person um through like periods of separation or maybe when you weren't being the most open with them they still stuck stuck around they were still here for you you're my confident you make me feel better so i feel like this person has proved to you like they've proved to you who they are divine timing i've always known i know what i'm capable of so i'll start off with this card i feel like this is you aquarius um a reason why you hold back your love is because you know that once you love you love hard and i will say that i feel like that's true for aquarius um you might have a small circle, but the circle that you do have, it's of people you really do care about. And it's it's filled with like unconditional love. So you know, Aquarius, even though you might be cold, at cold, um, you know that the love you are capable of giving is very powerful. We do have divine timing and I've always known. So with this connection, um... For some of you, you may, or I was going to say may and might, but you might have known your person. Um, this might not be so new to you. Um, this could be a person, Aquarius, where you met them initially and something may have stuck out to you about them. Or on the other hand, your person, they always stuck around because they knew that this could be something more. 
So I feel like someone in this connection had an idea about like the other person and they they kind of felt like this could turn into something more. And then with the divine timing, like I do feel like this connection is playing out in divine timing. Even you Aquarius, like with you maybe not forcing things as much, just trying to go with the flow of this connection. Um, it happened just how it was supposed to because by you maybe protecting your feelings with this connection, um, that's allowed your person to get a feel for you as well, observe you and maybe readjust because they do want to make this work, like readjust their approach to you or um, make you feel as it's as if it's okay to maybe get closer to them. <clears throat> so I feel like not forcing this connection has helped it grow. I hate doing wrong. It doesn't feel good to me or you. I'm the creator of my own actions. Honestly, I feel like this is you, Aquarius. Um, but it could be you or your persons if the energy, if you feel like the energy is reversed or the roles are reversed. I feel like this is you um, when you might be in isolation from your person. You might be a little bit cold just in your feelings to yourself. Um, you could just like ignore them. It's not personal, but you know that they might take it personally. And it's like how they've helped you. You feel like they don't deserve it, but then again, it's nothing personal. So depending on who that is for within this connection, I do feel like something that has gotten better within this connection and can definitely get better is just communication between you two. Um, your person has already learned a lot about you and I feel like you've learned a lot about them, but at the same time, with divine timing at play that doesn't mean that everything is just going to fall into place so easily there's still some things that can maybe be manipulated as far as changing up habits um to accommodate one another's needs but that's all i do have for my aquariuses today or my aquarians um i hope it resonates please like comment and subscribe and i'll talk to you next time bye